For the launch of iOS 13, I thought it'd be fun to take a closer look at stickers and how we can use them in our messaging apps. We're going to go through how to create our very own emoji and why assembly can give us the flexibility to use them in fun and engaging ways. Let's start by taking a selfie and importing it into our canvas. The first thing we're going to need to do is go to our basic shapes drawer and use circles and squares to create a simple shape of our head. It doesn't matter how many shapes we use, the important thing is to keep the edges of our final shape smooth. This will be the foundation of all the other elements. Finally, we just need to fill in the gaps in the middle. Once you have all your face covered, simply select all, go into Boolean and combine. Now let's create some ears by grabbing a simple shape and adjusting it in the point editing mode. Let's change the color of these three elements, making the ears a slightly darker tone than the face. Using this process, you can quickly add other elements. I'm gonna add the neck and body. The point of interest will be the face, so we can keep this element nice and simple. I'm being very conscious that I need to crop the body so it looks right in our final sticker. Now it's time to move on to the eyes, nose and mouth. Let's reduce the transparency of the face and move the other bits out the way so we can clearly see my expression. Let's start with my main character feature, other than my follically challenged head, my glasses. Now let's add in some eyes. You might think about rescaling your eyes so they're much bigger, but for this, I'm going to use my photo as the reference size. For both the eyes and the nose, I've used shapes from the build your own emoji drawer and the basic shapes drawer. I've just taken the bottom bit of one of the noses for this sticker. Finally, for the mouth, I'm going to use a curved spline. Let's just adjust the position of all these elements to get them right. I have to say, this image is now looking slightly scary. Let's quickly add back the body and move it over to the side. That's better. Now I have my main likeness done. Maybe I should go off and give myself some hair. Maybe not. I've just noticed I forgot my eyebrows, so let's quickly go back into the emoji drawer and grab some from there. Right, now let's give this emoji a border. Select all the object, go into Boolean and combine. Now reduce the transparency of the fill and bring up the stroke. Place this behind our main object. Select all and group. Let's put this back in the canvas area and remove our photo. We have our emoji. But how are we going to use it? Well, as it so happens, I need to ask my wife what she wants for food tonight. So let's head on over to the food drawer. Let's grab a pizza and let's grab some Chinese. Let's save this to our stickers and go over to Messenger. Scroll to the right until you find assembly. Tap on the icon and then tap on my stickers and it will be there waiting for you. Really hope you've enjoyed this tutorial. See you again next time.